Greetings and welcome, fellow sovereigns, to another episode of Let's Play or Let's Have a Look at High Strategy Orodros. Right, well, we finished the game. Oh, oops. Finished the game on hard. And where the world? Where were we again? Uh, Calafria, right. And it is indeed very hard. Or hard, rather. Let's go look for somewhere that is very hard. Verbally, somewhere where we're not immediately next to someone that's gonna overwhelm us. Or also not immediately next to someone that we don't really like. Or we've been uh, close to before. In a dominion that's right next to everyone, but you do have a couple of. Uh, you have one city that's kind of protected. Yeah, no. Let's let's look for a bit longer. I mean, the very nature of picking somewhere very hard. All right, let's let's try on another island, Klahuran. A Tazanek colony that took advantage of the distant homeland's mysterious calamity to forge his own path. Leaders of Tlahran feared the worst and worried that their homeland's reckless exploration had somehow led to its downfall. Leading ancestry is Tazanek. Seafaring invaders from across the great ocean have adopted local sects because their traditional gods were uh, place spirits. These sect is glowing stones. Our starting army are the Sailfin Tyrant and the Beast Warriors. We have a deadline of 300 turns, so this should be relatively quick. Alright, so. Well, we already have three cities that are in relatively short distance to us, for us to potentially take. Uh, I think our immediate goal should probably be to keep, uh, get new Zakatl. Uh, under our control, since it does have some population and pops with our particular religion. Currently, we are cautious with both of them, which is fair enough. No need to change stances until we switch over to, uh, until we're ready to attack. Uh, Alright, let's have a look at anything else. We currently have access to archers and shield bearers, and we can create beast warriors. And Elfin Tyrants. Now, these armies do not get upgrades. I don't know if that's on purpose. I mean, there's also the Greater Tyrant, but I guess it's the swimming variety. But essentially, these are just what we have. Currently, we are decked out to be particularly effective in swamps, and we're okay in jungles and plains. We should absolutely never fight in deserts with this combination. If we wanted to fight in deserts, uh, I mean, there is an option for it, but probably best we don't. Currently, we do not have any desert terrain near us. We have jungles. We have some mountains, which I don't think we're very good at. There's, there's plains. The nearest desert to us is... Uh, down here. We have no reason to go down here. I don't know exactly where the homeland of the uh, of our people are. Kind of curious where that might be. And across from the great ocean. No, it's not these guys. I mean, it did say our land was collapsed. That's fine. Uh, let's see. We do not know what their army composition is, I think. We don't know, indeed. And the League of Squalls. Currently, they wish to coexist. They don't consider us a threat. And they don't really trust us. 
Hmm. Well. First off, let's make a bit of money. Do some sports. Do some assertions. Right. Leak is calls is ready to move. I don't think I'm ready for anything particularly. How good is our army on the mountains? It's not. Well, we don't have to focus on those. I mean, if I can just take these three uh, goals, I'd be kind of happy. Pushing further south, I guess we can try. I should also probably check if our sects are lining up. So, two filling and the mastigosis. We probably want to get the glowing stones as happy as possible, so if I grab these. Right, so only one unit in here that is not happy. You are not happy. need for development let's keep trading now they're expanding that's potentially bad for us you are absolutely not happy because of the assertions much I can do about that because I cannot do an appease just yet. You know what? Let's just conscript. And there we go. Defense, they have the exact same problem as the same army as us. Alright. You are aggressive, then we are also aggressive. You know, let's be friendly with you for now. Alright, so we have absolutely no advantage over the enemy. We need to make an advantage. Ascavi is a competing minority, which has yielded us the sand raiders, which I think probably are very good in the desert. Yeah, they also have fire lances and shield bearers.
bin. Assert a little bit more power out of these people. Aye, this is unfair. And now I have no people. You are. Well, I'm not ready to fight you, so I'm just put on defensive. Oh, come on, give me some luck, please. chance you're being attacked somewhere else. Oh, now you're friendly. Bastards. cities are pretty much not as close enough friendly.
Yeah, I'm pretty sure they will defend if I try to attack that way. Happiness is my own ancestry is just essentially wiped out to the present time. Mm. All right, what exactly am I trying to support? I should probably switch to Overround. We are now in favor of these things. That's probably not going to work. Right. Perhaps I can use this. Who are they going to defend against? Against... has brought some more people back into the fold. Let's clear this up again. of the eye. Yeah, I'm not sure that's gonna work, but I'm gonna try. In any case, that'll do for this episode. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time. If you enjoy my content, please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all then. Bye!